And welcome back everybody, it is time to finish this zombie apocalypse car and I've done the liberty of kind of picking out some parts, things I wanted to put on because I, I, I don't like in my episodes me mindlessly looking through the menus as you guys just kind of sit there and boredom. So I've tried to uh, kind of do it myself and it looks like we've got some colliding here going on. So we'll fix it. No. Something is not agreeing with Mr. Wheel. I think it's this uh this harpoon that's going in all crazy. So we're gonna remove that right quick. Uh remove. Mm -hmm. Remove her. Goodbye. Does that fix it? Something's still hitting on that. I mean, it looks like this screen thing is, but I have no collide on. I think it's still being pushed out. Let's see if we can't fix that. And if not, then... Oh well. Oh. Did that fix it? Except now it's kind of doing it on this side. We're good to go. We've got our specs in the front. All right, so what I've thought to do with these is these are like side windows to put on here on the sides. I'm gonna put this I-beam welded on the back and then uh, we're gonna mount a couch on the back with some chairs so people can sit facing backwards with guns and shoot the zombies that are coming up from behind. Uh, random pumpkin bomb, I don't know. And I have this I-beam I wanted to put kind of through the middle back here and I was going to place some moving saws on either side. So let's see if we can actually get this going. Uh, let's go ahead and add the no collide. Of course, let's do it to this. Okay, now let's plot the old welder. Sure, that one. It's a lot taller than I thought it was. <laughs> oh well, no Clyde. That. Let's try and put this one on. wasn't the best lined up. Alright, let's try this again. No collide. This, this, this. Now I notice we're getting a little front heavy here. Um, so hopefully this is, actually not hopefully, this is not going to help our problem. That is for sure. But we're going to do it anyway. Alright, let's try and get this. Oh, that's better. Much better. <laughs> it's so bad. Oh, it's so bad. But, you know, when you gotta survive in the zombie apocalypse, you'll take whatever moves, I guess. Alright, and you can see I, I tried the harpoon here on Mr. Monk. Uh, kinda worked, kinda didn't, but uh, I wasn't expecting it to impale them, so. Let's see, no collide. Alright, now let's... Well, first we need to weld the I-beam, of course. Well, that's weighing it down in the back. <laughs> Got a little junk in the trunk. Alright. Let's weld this. See? We'll just undo that. That doesn't look... First we need to add no collide to the... I have a few 
feeling this is not going to turn out well. Alright, there we go. Um, the well is acting all silly. I think we might be putting a little too much weight back here. driving anymore. Oh, we'll just have to put some thrusters on this bad boy. That'll make it go. We'll see. Let's try that. Uh, well, let's put the couch on. Alright, this is gonna be a complete failure. Let's weld this. friends sitting in the back. Does that help? I can hear the engine trying to go, but uh, we might be stuck on the monk. <laughs> no, it's still not going. <sighs> oh dear. Oh well. well. We'll make it go. We'll make it go. Uh, let's weld these seats on. for all the hombres in the back to shoot the zombies. Alright. We might want to think about putting some wheels on this. Maybe that'll help us out wheels. Um, this little guys. We do want to lift it up though. We're moving. That's 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 a good sign. It doesn't stop very quick. I still might have to add some thrusters. We're gonna add thrusters to make it turn, of course. But uh, all right. So now let's see how well this I beam saw idea goes through. I'm not holding my breath here. Um, let's attempt to put this in place. This is gonna be so heavy. This is gonna this is gonna break it right here. Oops. Okay. Didn't break it. Still moves. It's a good sign. Good sign. All right. So for these, the, the idea I had was uh, oh easy. The idea I had was these wheels, you can actually get kind of saw blade looking ones. And so what I wanted to do, well, we could even put propellers. Yeah, let's put propellers on there. This is going to chop up anybody that comes close. <laughs> it might help in our movie. No, oh, the other one's jammed. Uh, is this one smaller? Oh, definitely not. And I just undid the other one, me and that. What is that? Oh, it's a tail one, I think. Son of a gun. Gotta stop pushing that. I need to, like, take the Z key off my keyboard. It's alright, we need to reposition this anyway. Okay, that looks about even. Yeah, that's better. Let's re-weld it.
Okay. Now, as far as wheels go, let's try these out instead. Those look a lot better. This will work like... Those will work like a saw. In my head would work. We're gonna put some facing... Like that. In case they get up close. And like that. Alright, let's try. Let's press forward. Yes. <laughs> Except we're not, oh, it's because the beam is held in place. All right, um, let's get this wrapped up. Let's, uh, let's see, we've got our thing on the back where our homeboys are gonna sit. We need to attach, you know what? I'm not gonna go with the dome. Uh, we're just gonna say adios to Mr. Dome. Peace. Okay, mm, that's, that's a little dangerous to have on board. And what was this? Oh yes, I was gonna put a gravestone somewhere, but I think I changed my mind. Uh, let's make a roof. Let's see, what's this? Furniture shelf. Ooh, small. Uh, let's, use, <laughs> let's use the flimsy mattress. Uh, the pea-stained mattress. Yes. No, it's just too flimsy. Not gonna work. Uh, let's use a door. Ooh, it's even got a slot on top. That's a nice touch. Okay. You know what? We're gonna line them like this. We're actually gonna need three of these. Uh, where was it? This one? Two, three. Ooh. Easy, boys. Where? Come back. Okay. Uh, belt. Let's get the middle square right underneath there. Oh, wait, that's not gonna work. Okay, we're gonna need to grab an end like this. And we'll no collide them in a moment. And if you're wondering, I'm using this grid add-on that makes it very handy to uh, to move things on and off somewhat accurately. And come on now, try that one. There. No. Oh my gosh. No. No. Oh. My, oh. Chaos. Okay, everybody just calm down. Just calm down. You get out. You get out. Let's try this again. Okay, right there. Right there. That's good enough. Spin around. Okay. Now you, right there. Right there. Right there. And now let's weld down this other side. Okay, so we've, <laughs> we've got our front fishbowl. We've got a roof, some side windows, our couch in the back where our friends are going to sit. And now we need something to turn. Thrusters. We'll put, uh, what's this? Yeah, that'll do. Alright, so forward, if I want to go right, is actually going to be left. And if I want to go that way, it's going to be that way. We're going to put the force. Let's try that. Let's put the thing on rings. Uh, yeah, let's put it on the wheels. Now I need to switch the controls where this is right arrow. This is left arrow. <laughs> this is gonna be terrible. And we'll add a couple thrusters here on the back because we are gonna need all the help we can get to get moving. We're gonna make that, oop. And we're gonna make that back. Uh, we'll go with trash cans of love. 
we'll just go with one trash can up there. Wow, this is ours. <laughs> this is our zombie apocalypse. Oh, let's... Okay, okay. Let's... <laughs> e easy, easy. Right, apparently the thrusters are way too much. Definitely <laughs> need to turn those down. Okay, let's let's turn those down. Everybody just calm down. Uh, I'm gonna put that down at like 500. Um, I'm gonna make this. Let's see if I want to turn right. I want it to go forward. So this, this. Put it right there. And then this is left arrow. This is right arrow. Put it there. Now let's see if it'll go without a thruster. All right, we're moving. Turn. <laughs> yes, it lives. Oh, turn faster, turn faster. Oh, we made it. Yes. All right, let's take now. Uh, <laughs> this is terrible. So we didn't need a thruster on the back. That's good. Uh, let's hop in. Let's go for a ride. Now you can see our lovely blades here on the side. We'll catch the zombies as we drive around. We've got our harpoons on the front. Turns somewhat good. I, I hear something breaking. <laughs> Oh, this is amazing. This is the best zombie apocalypse car anybody could ask for. Um, let's actually take a ride from uh, the back seat. Let's hop in here. Alright, so I'm going to be driving this backwards. So this is what you would see if you were sitting on the back. Zombies are running up and you'd be shooting your gun. Doing drive-bys with zombies. If they get too close, they hit those blades over there. Um, I I am honestly surprised it's driving. Let's let's be honest. I, who had faith that it was going to drive? I didn't. <laughs> but it worked. No, oh, it worked. It's it's the most it's the ugliest thing you'd ever seen. And uh, you know, if any zombie did ever try to attack me, instant death. They'd come right through that hole, probably break the glass. Uh, but. Those saw blades on the side. Oh, only on my channel will you see something this bad make me so excited to see it moving. All right, folks, let's go ahead and park this in the garage. I, I figured I'm gonna make this like my creations garage. Oh, stop, 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 stop. Back up. This way, back up. All right, let's make, let's take her in the old garage. Park it. Alright, slow it down. Slow, slow. This is gonna be the creations garage. We're gonna lock it in place. Uh, which part should we lock in place? Okay, so now if I press forward, it doesn't go anywhere. Alright! Excited! We got it. I lost that other creation because I forgot to save the game. Um, but I'm going to save the game and uh, we'll put up a big sign, big banner, in case of zombie apocalypse, don't use this. <laughs> anyway, folks, uh, this is Skidoo. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting my channel. I'm almost to 400. Actually, I'll probably be 400 subscribers by the time I upload this video. Thanks so much for making it worth my while to make these videos because I do enjoy interacting with you guys, having fun, talking, and hopefully if somebody can help me with this whole dedicated server thing for Windows 7 64-bit, um, I can get some of you on here with me because it is much more exciting when you get other people on here and you don't just have to listen to me talk to my computer screen. Anyway, rate, subscribe, thumbs up. This is Skidoo. I'll catch you later. Peace.